Leroy's Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver Walkthrough, Part 55. Welcome back, kids, and we're here in Fuchsia City, ready to take on the gym leader, Janine. Now, Janine is, like, the one of the easiest gym leaders here in the after game, but you gotta fight her anyways. Um, she's stepping in place for Koga. As we all know, Koga became, like, the big deal, went on to the Elite Four, so they needed someone to fill in for him. And that's why we're stuck with Janine, so let's go ahead and fight her. And I did a pretty good job avoiding those invisible walls, I gotta admit, so... Yeah, I get to pat myself on the back there. Um, but yeah, the gym leader uses Poison-type Pokémon. Um, and she wears a cape, because I guess she thinks she's so cool or something. But yeah, she starts out with a Crobat. This is the most annoying Pokémon ever, alright? It knows Confuse Ray and Supersonic. Two moves that will confuse your Pokémon. Like, the most annoying thing ever. Like, who thought of that, giving it Confuse Ray and Supersonic? Um, so pretty much prepare to get confused if you're facing Crobat. Um, yeah, right off the bat, it's gonna use Confuse Ray, but luckily it's weak to Rock, Electric, Psychic, and Ice. So I have the Rock-type, um, Golem to take this thing out. But of course, I'm gonna have to hit myself in Confusion several times first, I'm guessing. <laughs> but yeah, um, guys, the thing about Crobat, its only attacking move is Wing Attack. Alright, so if you have any Pokemon that, they can, that can take a Flying-type hit, then send it in, because that's all it can really do to you, other than Confuse Ray, of course. Um, but yeah, from an offensive standpoint, Wing Attack's all it's got, so send in something that can, that can take a Flying-type move, and you'll be fine. Is that like the third time in a row I hit myself? That's ridiculous. Alright, so, we are getting unlucky. There we go, we snapped out of Confusion. And once he actually managed to hit it, it's not too bad, but seriously, I hit myself in confusion three times in a row. That is absolutely ridiculous. Alright, let's go with another Rock Blast. And I can take these wing attacks all day. Hey, what do you know I missed? Well, I guess that's what I get for using slightly inaccurate moves. Oh, and you get a critical hit. Wow, you are, like, getting so lucky in this battle, it makes me angry. Um, but we're finally gonna get rid of this thing, so woohoo! I hate you, Crobat. <laughs> Actually, I love using Crobat on my team, but I hate facing Crobat, the most annoying Pokemon ever. So, once you get that thing out of the way, congratulations to you, you're so awesome. And guess what? My Heracross grew up a level, because I have the experience share on him. Um, anyways, she is going to her next Pokemon, which is Weezing, and I am definitely going to switch out. Weezing is a Poison-type Pokemon, it's only weak to Psychic-type moves. Um, kind of a pain to match up against, but you fought Weezing a ton in this game, you kind of know how it works. Um, use your special attacking moves. By the way, I'm taking this opportunity to heal up my Golem. Um, because he's almost dead after hitting himself a million times in a row through confusion, so yeah. Now, Weezing is kind of annoying. It likes to use Toxic. It will even use the move Explosion to, like, kill everyone on the field. Um, but other than that, it just likes to use Sludge Bomb, so... Sludge Bomb's the main attacking move it uses. If you have something that can take Poison-type moves, then go ahead and send it in. Um, but definitely use special attacks. Don't use your physical attacks. They will not work very well. Definitely special attacks. Like, Surf, look how much damage that did. A whole lot, so... Be smart about it. Um, you're probably gonna have to deal with getting poisoned. Big deal. Just bring some full heals or something like that. And you'll be just fine. And wow, that did a lot of damage. So, Surf, we're gonna knock this thing out. And the Toxic's probably gonna finish me off, but Lantern did its job anyway, so I'm not really too worried about it. Alright, we get our experience, and so does Heracross. And goodbye, Aqua Volt. Whoa, we lived with one hit point! Yes! That is awesome. Alright, so one hit point left out of 163. And you better get out of here, Aqua Volt. So we'll go back to Rocky, who is fully healed up after using that Hyper Potion. And she's going to go to Ariados. Ariados is a super crappy Pokemon. It's Bug and Poison type. Um, it's weak to Flying, Rock, Fire, and Psychic. It's really bad. It's just not good. I don't know what else to say other than it's it's terrible. So we're going to go ahead and use Rock Blast and hopefully knock it out. Um, she has two of these things on her team. Neither of them are very good. They pretty much just know, like, stupid moves like Pin Missile. Like, really, Pin Missile? You have a move that weak? But I've never heard of anyone struggling to take out an Ariados in my life. And this will not be the first time. So down goes Ariados. Easiest kill of your life, seriously. I mean, it's not even fast. Like, usually Pokemon that are that crappy with offense and defense are at least fast. But no, Ariados is slow, so it's just, it's all around terrible. Um, Venomoth is a Pokemon pretty similar to Ariados. It has the same weaknesses. Flying, Rock, Fire, and Psychic. So we're just going to go with the same move here. Rock Blast. 
Um, it's a little bit more powerful offensively, though. As you can see, Signal Beam does a decent chunk. It also knows Psychic and Sludge Bomb. Um, this thing likes to use Double Team, which is pretty annoying, so... Go in for the kill early, don't mess around too long, otherwise it will raise up its evasion and annoy the crap out of you. But yeah, this thing is at level 50, so, um... Yeah, pretty high in levels, but it really shouldn't be too bad. It's not overwhelmingly powerful. Um, but yeah, Rocky is actually about to die, so we'll switch over to Batman and hopefully live a hit. Ooh, you're gonna use Psychic! You must have predicted my switch into Crobat or something. Um, but yeah, Crobat's barely gonna live, which is nice, so we can outspeed you and finish you off here with a fly. But yeah, none of her Pokémon can really just, like, dominate the entire game. Venomoth's pretty weak. I mean, it's, it's okay, but it's not good enough to, like, wipe out your whole team. Weezing's just defensive, and Crobat's just annoying, so... Really not too tough of a fight. Alright, so Batman, you're gonna get off the hook there. And last up is her final area dose, and you know what? I'm just gonna stay in. Even though I only have 21 hit points, I'm just going to knock you out in one hit, because, did I mention, area dose is really crappy. I mean, I'm actually kind of disappointed at how terrible area dose is. I mean, I think it's a cool Pokémon. Um, I like having the spider Pokemon, but it's it's so bad. Like, why do you have to be so bad? There's nothing good about it at all. It's like, it's cool, but it's just, it's terrible. So there, there we go. It's knocked out, and that is it for Janine. Easiest gym fight ever. Alright, so yeah, I mean, if we were fighting Koga, maybe it would have been a decent challenge, but you just are nothing like Koga. Alright, so we get the soul badge. Woohoo! I have no idea how many gym badges we have here in the after game. I am not keeping track. Mainly because I'm going out of order all over the place. Um, after that, you get TM84, which is Poison Jab. A pretty decent poison type move. And with that said, we will get out of this place. Um, so that's going to be it for Fuchsia City. Now that we have our gym badge, we can head out. And I guess we have some decisions to make. We can either head south or we can head west. Um, not west, east. And by the way, I'm a certified trainer. Certified gym leader champion, dude. Anyways, yeah, we're not gonna go west, because we came from the west. You know what? We're probably gonna go south next time. I made up my mind. We're gonna go south towards Cinnabar Island. That's what's happening next time. Thanks for watching, everybody, and stay tuned for more. Don't do drugs.